Hi guys, so um, in general, you don't want to be using too much humor and uh, rhymes and jingles and things like that. In general, you want to be selling most of the time. However, when it comes to email copywriting, uh, basically you are in people's inbox every day or every week, depending on how often you email. They know who you are, and you are sending you are sending them valuable emails. And in that particular case, it is okay to have a fun headline, right? And uh, you can do like the the tabloid newspapers, right? So I wrote this headline here: Elvis seen dining with famous copywriter. And then here I put inside the email, El Elvis seen dining with me, question mark. And the email is very simple. Yes, you can use celebrities to promote your business. If Elvis were alive, he would be a hell of an endorser. But what if you can't afford a celebrity? In that case, you can try to become a local celebrity. This can be done with outrageous advertising, the way P.T. Barnum might have done it. Look at the following ad where P.T. Barnum showcased a mermaid, obviously not a real one, but still the crowds loved it. So see how I turned a, um, a fun headline into a teaching email that is uh, useful to the reader yeah uh, so now they know that if they use you know outrageous advertising as in costumes or maybe stunts uh, that they could see um, a lot of interest come to their uh, sales event for example so if you're interested in this type of uh, emails yeah you will learn from me you will you will see you'll have actionable information that you can use in your advertising on a daily basis and it's short you see you don't have to read a lot it's just a couple of lines and you learn a lot yeah so that's my email list and you can sign up to it by getting my free ebook in the description yeah um, this was an idea that I learned from Ben Settle, and you can learn from me. Thank you.